Hey guys, I've had a few people tell me that they've had their door, the dirt cup door fall, uh, come off of this machine. And a few people ask me how exactly uh, to put these back on. So here is a video for you. Um, I'm gonna, just gonna pop this off just to, um, maybe I can get it a little bit more close up. But basically, um, as long as these did not break, these two little tabs here, as long as these didn't break, um, you're okay. And as long as this piece did not break, you are okay to just pop it back on. You don't need to replace this whole bin. So one of my commenters was saying that Dyson was telling her she had to replace this whole bin. So um, now where these go is these go right back in there. There's two little holes here and here. And if you squeeze this bin like that, you can just pop it. It kind of spreads those openings out. See if I, uh, if you put it in facing up when it's facing down like this and then squeeze the bin. So it kind of makes this shape more of an oval. If you squeeze it, it actually gives you a little bit of clearance. So you can just pop it right in just like that. All right, so that's how I do it. And um, I've had many customers come in with this problem and um, typically I can do it while they wait and uh, if I'm not super busy and take care of them. So I hope this was helpful and uh, let me know in the comments and please like and subscribe if you wanna see more videos. Thanks, have a great day. So let me just walk you through how to install this. Um, this assembly here. This can be somewhat uh, complicated as well if you have removed this. Um, but basically you have all these these little channels here and you've got to just make sure they line up um, accordingly to this area here. So you're going to install it kind of starting out right about there. Okay, and then now you can slide up and it pops in place. Okay, let me show you that one more time. All right, so you've got these three sets of uh, little channel pieces sticking out and those have to correspond with um, here, here, and here, which the bottom one's tricky. All right, so you've got to install it below that, below those little hook areas. So just like that. And then if you, as long as it's flush all along the side there, then you can go ahead and push up and it will pop in place. And you want to look here, this red, this red gap, this red piece and this gray piece here are perfectly flush. There's no gap there. So that's how you know. Now don't shut it until you've put your uh, cycling assembly in and there's a channel here and it's gonna slide down right inside of this little channel. Or there's a rail, I guess. That's rail and channel is the proper term. Just push it down like that and then you can close the door. Let's see if we got it. Okay. Now you always have to close this. You have to Drop this down before you close the bin. And then you can close it. If you do it beforehand and you close this and then close it, something messes it up. I'm not sure exactly what it is, but something gets all jacked up. So I think that's one of the reasons people get this broken. All right, 